culture for cadet upright verbena this purple here cadet upright purple was grown in a one gallon pot this is our fall finish but specifically we want to talk about spring production and break it down into two climates that we grew culture trials for cadet upright verbena in that's california and chicago for the midwest so in california we grew our cadet upright verbena for a week 15 finish that means we stuck on week four we transplanted on week 10 with a week eight pinch and we finished on week 15. That's 11 week crop time. Now, because we're in California, we grew in this beautiful high tunnel with no heat at night during the spring. And our average daily temperature was um, cooler. We're talking like 61 degrees. So our night temps were hovering just around 50 degrees and our daytime temps were warm and sunny. Our moles in those months are pretty high. So here in uh, February outdoors, we can already have on average 27 moles a day. And then going into March, we're already at 36 moles a day when you're growing outside like this. So bright and cool, you can grow Cadet Upright Verbena with absolutely no PGRs. Just give it a pinch. As long as you can maintain that 50 degree nighttime temperature, you're gonna produce a perfect quart Cadet Upright Verbena with no PGRs. Now, when we shift to West Chicago, and here's the picture of what the pot looked like in California of that court finished perfectly with no PGRs. Now let's jump to West Chicago. Let's look at the de details of how we grew a cadet upright in the greenhouse, growing it warm when you're trying to force the crop. So we were targeting a week 13 or 14 finish, about as early as you would finish in West Chicago. And we stuck on week 52. Now here you can see uh, next to me is a picture of what the liner looked like of Cadet Upright when it was transplanted right around uh, week four. We pinched that product one week before transplant. So the pinch was done week three. And again, we had a finish of week 13. Now, what's the difference between the California and the West Chicago location? Well, it's always about the light. The biggest difference that we saw in Chicago is in January, we're only getting 1.9 moles of light on average per day growing in a greenhouse, growing warm. Then in February, we bump, bump up to 4.7 per day, March 6.9. So we're almost a tenth of the amount of light when you compare California to Chicago. And we were forcing these warm. So the average daily temperature was 68 degrees. And you can see the finished pot here beside me of Cadet upright, grown in Chicago, grown warm, and what we found was the best PGR recommendation was either a bonsai drench or florel treatments to get that nicely branched habit, keep the, the habit just compact enough to ship it out of your greenhouse quick and have a successful turn of compact upright verbena that's easy for you to grow. Remember, Cadet Upright is one week earlier than the competition, has the same summer flower performance as Endurascape when grown in pots, and excellent mildew tolerance over the competition. So an all around great product and easy culture guidelines for you to follow. Please visit ballfloraplant.com to get the full PowerPoint of how we did California culture trials and Chicago trials on Cadet Upright. Thanks for tuning in. Keep the plants happy and they're gonna keep you happy.